Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Hey, what's up, guys? It's MKBHD here, filming a tutorial for youtube.com slash lockergnome and lockergnome.com. In this video, I'm going to be showing you a freeware pack, not just one piece of software, but multiple pieces of software. So if you go ahead and give a visit to dvdvideosoft.com, and I'm sure there will be a link somewhere in the description, you can see that there is a massive amount of programs available at this site, and they call it a free studio over here on the right-hand side. They call it a studio because if you download this one studio pack, you'll be able to manage every single thing on this list you see here, a very useful freeware for free. And these are all very important and very useful pieces of freeware. So let me go ahead and show you what it looks like once you've downloaded this exact pack. Once you've downloaded and installed the free studio manager, you can go ahead and run it for the first time. It'll go ahead and put an icon on your desktop to make this easy. Double click the icon and you'll come up with the Free Studio Manager 4.2, which is the latest version for Windows. So you have a number of functions in the Free Studio and you can select a category to get started working on your files. So you can choose between internet functions, DVD and video functions, MP3 and audio functions, and CD and other functions. So for example, if we wanted to choose an internet function, there are a lot of different things under internet in this freeware package. For example, there's a free YouTube downloader, a YouTube uploader, and several other converters from YouTube videos. To go back to the main menu, we just hit the X in the top right hand corner of the uh, Studio Manager. Others include, uh, for example, if we go under MP3 and audio, we can look at a free audio dub or a free YouTube to MP3 downloader. We can go back, of course, using the X bar and uh, view the main menu. The cool thing about having this Studio Manager is that when you download it and install it, which only takes about 30 seconds, you actually get all of the freeware you see here. So if we go under MP3 and Audio, and say we want to convert some audio file from M4A to MP3 or something, clicking on it brings up the audio converter and everything is ready to go. All you have to do is browse for your file, browse for your output folder and format, and you're ready to hit Convert. This is what it's basically like for all of the applications, no matter what the function of it is. For example, if I go under Internet and go to YouTube Download, we can go ahead and paste a URL, select an output folder and a format, and begin the download. So all of the software looks the same, and it's very intuitive, and it comes in a nice, fresh design uh, that is very easy to use. So this has been a short video tutorial from MKBHD for the Locker Gnome YouTube channel, and I hope you enjoyed it. And thanks for watching this video on the free studio manager from dvdvideosoft.com. If you have any other questions, feel free to check out their website or leave a comment. Thank you for watching. Peace.